Hey, this is Brett, and this 2021 Ford Transit Connect XLT is stock number 13565Z. I am here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used van headquarters. This 2021 Ford Transit Connect has the two liter four cylinder engine, which puts out 162 horsepower. This van has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop, has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off and it is 100% ready to go. I'm gonna go all the way around in this video, inside, underneath, start it up and take a look under the hood. Frozen white is the color and I shoot all my videos in 4K. So if you have HD capabilities, turn them on right now because it is your best way to check out the quality, condition, options, and cleanliness of the vehicle before seeing it in person. As you go down this side of the van, you can see just how nice the doors and quarter and front fender are. Didn't see any dents or dings on there. If you like the video, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel, which is youtube.com slash summit auto. Click the bell notifications and you'll get updates on the videos I do each and every day here at Summit Automotive. This one comes with the steel wheels with the simulated covers on there. It has four wheel disc brakes and it also has Continental Pro Contact tires. These are 215 55R16s and I would say they have probably about half the tread left on there. Front fender's in great shape, factory fog lights and the front bumper is in really nice condition as well. I didn't see any major dents, dings or cracks. The grill is in nice condition too, and the hood is in really nice shape as well. Passenger side front fender looks really good. And the passenger side front wheel simulator is in nice shape as well. As you go down this side of this 2021, take note of how clean the body is, how reflective and mirror-like that paint is. Take these HD videos so if you are far away or even if you're close by and you just cannot make the trip down, but you're still interested in purchasing the vehicle, you can see the van, hear the van, and have confidence in the vehicle that you're looking at before you even get here. So when you do get here, there's no surprises and you can make a smart and informed buying decision from wherever you're at. If this video helps you make that decision, let your salesman know that you saw the video, that it was helpful and that Brett sent you. Back tires have just as much tread as the front tires. And from what you can see of the frame here, it's in really nice shape. This is a one owner out of Utah. You do get the capless fuel fill, which is always a nice feature on the Fords. Coming around to the back, you'll notice that it is an LWB or long wheelbase. Backup parking sensors and rear bumper is in really nice shape. You get these swing open doors with the glass back here. So these doors open up 90 degrees, but then you can push this button and actually open them up that far which is pretty nice. And the other thing you can do is you can put these seats down so you can have a nice flat floor all the way up to the second row and we'll put that second row seat down too. But uh, this is what it looks like when they're up. Nice and clean back here. And then when you close these, they just kind of snap back into place. You're all set to go. The rear doors are in excellent shape. I didn't see any dents or dings on them. And for full disclosure, this back wheel is in nice shape as well. Get the blind spot monitoring, blind spot mirrors. Inside the XLT package gives you the black cloth interior. You get the bucket, I'm sorry, bucket seats in the front. No rips or tears on them. Power driver's seat, factory floor mats, auto headlamps, power windows, locks, and mirrors. And uh, I think these mirrors actually fold in. Not sure how that works, but they do fold. I think the power's got to be on. So we'll check that out in a second. Second row bench seating. These seats are in fantastic condition. Does have the latch child safety system for any child car seats you may have. And like I said, these seats do fold down. And then you can pull this strap and they'll go down even farther. And you can see that you get a pretty nice flat floor to the back there. I think they might even go farther down or 
they I think they fold up. Or maybe not. Got to have that front seat up a little bit farther. Yeah, so there that's how flat they go. Um, so you can see it is nice and flat all the way from that third row. And then to put these back up, just got to release it. Then they snap into place. This backrest goes up like so, and you're all set to go. Back here, you get 110 volt, 150 watt plug-in and rear air controls, as well as factory floor mats. These are manual sliding doors. You can see that that slides very nice and smoothly. We'll hop inside, check out the miles, the radio, and everything that this van has to offer on the interior. You can see that this one has 16,211 miles on it. Instrument cluster is in nice shape. You get cruise controls, information center controls on the left, and Bluetooth controls on the right. You get the radio, the sync radio up there. You get AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities, as well as Bluetooth capabilities. You have all your different apps on here, your settings. And it has Ford Pass Connect, Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, so you can project your cell phone to the screen. And if you have a nav system on your phone projected up there, such as Waze or Google Maps, and it's like you have nav right on the screen, so that's a pretty sweet system. And then the backup camera shows up right there. Let's see if I can get these mirrors to power fold in. Yep. I always like showing both sides, so you know that both sides are working properly. Down here you get your climate controls, including your dual climate controls, your eco mode, traction control, and start stop button. Two USBs right there, automatic transmission shifter, and the passenger side floor mat and seat are in excellent condition. No rips or tears in there. The headliner is in nice shape, smells very clean inside this van, and you do get map lights up there. We'll start it up and take a look under the hood. Starts right up, no check engine lights or anything like that. You do get a digital speedometer and a compass display. Or I'm sorry, temperature display. Uh, we'll take a look under the hood, like I said. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and hopefully from this HD video, you've been able to verify the quality and condition of this van inside and out. Under the hood, we have the two liter four cylinder engine. Engine base very clean, runs very smooth. 162 horsepower. Once again, this fan has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop. Has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off. There is the emissions sticker. And this fan is 100% ready to go. I would highly recommend this van from a quality and condition standpoint. I think whoever gets it's going to be really happy with it. And to see more pictures of this van or one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, Minivans, Wranglers, half tons, three quarter tons, one tons, you name it. We gotta go to that website right there, summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video and all the videos that you see there. Click the bell notifications, you'll get updates on the videos I do each and every day here at Summit Automotive. In fact, in a second, you'll see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to more Transit Connect vans I've done in the upper right, a link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out. We're super excited to help you with this ultra clean 2021 Ford Transit Connect XLT in frozen white clear coat. Thanks again for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again.